This is not a chip. It looks like one, but legally, it's not even close. You see, in 1968, Procter & Gamble launched Pringles as Pringles Newfangled Potato Chips. But there was a problem. They're made from a paste including dehydrated processed potato, not sliced potatoes. Only 42% of this chip is actually a potato. So in 1975, the FDA ruled they couldn't solely call themselves potato chips. PNG's solution was to rebrand as potato crisps, but that created another problem in Europe. The EU had a 17.5% tax on potato crisps, so PNG went to court and argued that since Pringles are only 42% potato and have a shape not found in nature, they shouldn't be taxed as crisps. And it surprisingly worked. In 2008, the court agreed. Pringles are not crisps. They evaded the tax. Well, at least until 2009, when the British Court of Appeal overturned their previous ruling. So what are they? Technically, just a savory snack, whatever that means. But they've won two legal battles in the past, proving what they're not. What food should we break down next? 